What does it take to be the fastest car in the world? Extreme engineering, raw power, and a company willing to push the limits of physics. This is the story of how the Bugatti Veyron Supersport shattered the speed record. The original Bugatti Veyron was already a record breaker, hitting 253 miles per hour back in 2005. But Bugatti wasn't done. Competitors like the SSC Ultimate Aero threatened their dominance. Bugatti had to strike back, and they did with the Super Sport. The Super Sport wasn't just a Veyron with a new paint job. Bugatti engineers cranked up the 8.0L quad turbo W16 to a mind-blowing 1200 horsepower. The aerodynamics were optimized, the weight also optimized, and the tires, specially designed to handle speeds over 250 miles per hour. On July the 4th, 2010, at Volkswagen's secret Aerolessian test track, driver Pierre-Henri Raffinel took the Supersport to its limits. The result? An earth-shattering 267.8 miles per hour. That wasn't just fast, it was the new record for a production car. With this record, Bugatti cemented its place as the king of speed. The Veyron Supersport wasn't just a car, it was a statement. A machine that defied the impossible,